Well, welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading. I put the whole announcement at the end. I get tired of repeating the same thing. Okay, so it's at the end of the video. I don't like to be a hamster wheel, but there is a specific. There is an announcement for this one. Okay, it's an extended one and extended two. So there's two videos. Um, but I would be doing the whole how to date a zodiac. Each zodiac, I will identify them. You know, the good and the bad and the ugly. Um, so make sure you subscribe. And then it will be triggering. So I suggest you do not. Okay, basically, um, you know, do not take it against you because I'm talking about the zodiac. Not unless your name is Aquarius, then it's you. Okay, so I'm talking about a zodiac. Okay, because it's gonna be triggering. Okay, so no holds bar. Okay, <laughs> to all the zodiacs. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Okay, I'm gonna use the girl deck. Okay, first oracle deck is light and bubbly. Okay. So let's see what's going on here. Okay. Let's see. Got here, let the soulmate grow, grow without you. Well, that is triggering for the people who are codependent. Okay. But if you are not a codependent one, then fly. Okay. <laughs> this is what you're going to tell your person. Yes. You know. So they can exist without you, you know? You're, you know, you're not there, what do you call that? Um, is it the kidney or the lungs that you need to, okay? Whichever, okay? <laughs> or the lungs, okay? So you're not the left lung, right lung, okay? For this person. So if they want to grow, then let them grow. Uh, they want space, give them space. You know, this is, normally this is my East Coast, West Coast. So you might have that long distance relationship when the sun sets in your life, I mean, in your, in your place, you know, the moon, you know, all those things. And yeah, this is geographical distance when I made this. Okay. Mm. So let them grow, yes? Mm. Uh, but they need me. No, they don't. Okay. No, they don't. <laughs> It's like it ain't high school, okay? <laughs> no, I think even high school even have a good concept of how to date now. Yeah, they want to go, then go. <laughs> so that's that one. Mm. Let's see what's going on here, guys. Alrighty. This is for my aqua. Let's see. Alrighty. There's drama. Oh. First card is strongest. Five of cups. Mm. So this is about someone trying to fight for attention, either you or them. So who is it? Someone is sick, you know, they're, you never fight for a man that's stupid. I fight for a donut, especially if it's the last one, it's glazed. Okay? Now, if that man is that important, you tell me. Okay? You tell me. 
Nobody fights for a man. Okay, that's beneath you. But someone is fighting for attention here. Okay. Mm. These are having a fight right now. Nine of Pentacles. Okay. I feel like you're connecting with someone who's useless. Okay. Because, <laughs> you know, like, if you thought you caught them with one, there's another one, and there's another one. Okay. Because <laughs> uh, while you're going at it with that one person, they out there also, mm hmm, talking to another one. Yeah, we got a problem here. We have to call Houston. Houston, we have a problem. Mm -hmm. They're single. They're talking to people. And you're single too. So this can be you also. Someone is trying to fight for your attention. Who will win? Basically. Mm. You can be in the dating pool. You know, let me see. Oh, Ace of Swords. Well, someone's gonna get cut off. You might cut off this person. I feel like this person is making you as an option. Ace of Swords with the Five of Cups. You're an option to this person. And you know it yourself. Like, you're not going to waste your time here with Ace of Swords. That's why you're going to let the Selmet grow, grow without you. Let them face their own life, you know. You don't have to be with them. It's not, you know, it's not a life partner. Mm. Six of Swords. Okay. There's undisclosed feelings between the two of you. You caught this person talking to other people. These are for people who are dating. Yep. There was a lot of promise from this person. They didn't push through with those promises. You know, they made the pink elephant grow. You understand me? They fed the pink elephant. We're not going to be talking about getting serious or being serious. No. They put it on the table. It's up for discussion. But not really committing. Four of Swords, so you've healed from this person, yes? And you try to explore, you try to date, you know. I feel like that's the past energy right there. So you've broken up with this person who... There was nothing really serious about this. Okay, the only thing serious that you're getting from this person was drama. Okay, so it's a soap opera kind of relationship. I don't know why people want to get tangled in a soap opera. I swear. It doesn't get ratings, there is no views, you don't get monetized, and you're part of a drama. If I ain't making coins, uh-uh, this is stressing me, right? If we can't make love, let's make money. That's what I always say. There's two kinds of karma, okay? Mm. Find yourself into something useful instead of dealing with someone who is useless. Mm -hmm. Got the Eight of Swords. So you're still mourning, okay, the relationship. You haven't let go. You need to let go, Aqua. You need to let go. You need to let go. Eight and four of swords. You tried, but there are deep, deep feelings, deep fears that is inside you. This can be the other person. You got a quick king of wands. The king of wands does not look good here, ace of swords, no. Um, I feel like it's a bachelorette and bachelor, bachelorette energy. So this is what you cut off. Okay, self-serving. Mm -hmm. It's like a gas station. In a first world country, self-service, basically. Mm -hmm. mm. Under the Six of Swords. Oh, Two of Swords. So it came to a point where, are we going to be together or we're going to separate? I feel like you separated from them, Two of Swords. Mm -hmm. So it can be an Aries or a Scorpio there. You got me. Mm -hmm. mm. Get a Seven of Pentacles. You're waiting or whoever is waiting. Let's see. But right now, there is someone who's just, you know, who felt like, well, you know what? I put in time and work here. Okay. So, I don't know what you're waiting. Are you waiting for a message? Are you waiting for something to progress? Let's see. You got a Queen of Swords and a King of... You, you were waiting for this person to make up their mind and decide also. I feel like it was open-ended, meaning nothing, you know, it's like there was a lot of things that was unsaid. And, you know, it's like, you guys still need to figure it out. Mm -hmm. Three of Cups, Eight of Cups, Eight of Five of Cups. Well, you made sure that you can't be part of the Lady Marmalade, basically. Okay? So you're not part of the cast. Mm -hmm. So you ain't gonna be part of a menage a trois. Yes? Eight of Cups. So you walked away, you isolated yourself from this person. 
For you, reconciliation is not even an option. For you, it's like you can't be a side piece. Is what you're having here. Because they're self-serving. Can be very like egoistic kind of person. Get a five of wands, the knight of pentacles, and the nine of swords. They're stressed that you're not buying their excuse anymore. Is it for sale? Is it on discount? Aqua. Because you ain't buying. Is it? Mm -hmm. Is it? Because you're not buying this. They're stressed. Because they want to come to you, you know, in this pacing of a Knight of Pentacles. Bullcrap. Burn that Knight of Pentacles. It ain't going nowhere. It never did in 2019, 2018, 2017, 2015. Do I need to keep going back? For you to, to for to, for me to tell you that it ain't it didn't go nowhere. It ain't going nowhere this year. Mm-hmm. Mm. Love makes no promises, promises. There's nothing I can do. I never mm-hmm. Twelve Pentacles, the full card magician. They still don't know what to do with their life. Let them figure it out. You're not a teacher. Not unless your name is Jupiter. Are you, is your name Jupiter? No, you're not. So you're not going to teach this person. Tell Pentacles, the full card magician. It's just like, I don't know. Maybe. What not? Eh? <laughs> Please. It's not a red flag. Mm -mm. It says flags written over the, all over this person. Save yourself some time of the day. Okay? Delete the person from your phone book, from your Instagram, social media. It ain't going nowhere. Mm-hmm. Seven of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Seven of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. Run. Never look back. That's them. And that's not you who's there kissing their hands. Ace of Pentacles, the promise that they're going to be serious with you. Eight of Swords, that's what you're holding onto. Onto. Into whatever. They promise something. Okay. And the Seven of Wands energy here, you know. Run. They want to see you. You guys will meet again. Seven of Pentacles. This is, this is a different Seven of Pentacles. You're going to run away from this person. Because you ain't waiting for them anymore. Queen of Swords. Can't make up your mind? It's easy, boo. Live your life. Let them grow. Grow without you. Okay. So, I'm going to continue this reading. Link down there in the description box next is the extended two. The major announcement is at the end of this video. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, Aqua. Bye, guys. Hi, Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your bi-weekly. This is 1 to the 15, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's see what you guys have for me. Okay. Mm -mm -mm, mm -mm -mm -mm. How is everybody? Okay. Things are going fast. It's 2019. Here we go. Okay. 1 to the 15. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let me see. For my aquas. Let me see if I'm going to be an aqua today. Here we go. 1 to the 15. I got a page of ones. There's chemistry between the two of you. You know? Either you or this person. But this is more of like, for me, it's a baby card. Meaning, when they want you, they want you. And when they're throwing tantrums, they don't want you. Okay? So someone is feeling, it's like, well, I want you, you know, it's like, you who, you know, look at this person's energy. It's like, hey, someone is trying to catch your attention. Uh -huh. Can be younger fire sign also. You know, showing you the hints. This is the hints. Also, because they don't know, that's why their feet is crossed. Meaning they're uncertain how, how they're going to be perceived or if they're going to be accepted. Okay. <laughs> with a hierophant energy it's like I want you I want you to be committed to me <laughs> it's a Taurus energy of course now this is very interesting because someone is treading here okay. but this is what they really want but they don't know if this is something that the other person is welcoming is it even something that the other person will consider and that's why they feel like, well, I should just, you know, kind of slowly move in. Or, you know, I just start leaving my toothbrush here. You know, I just start to leave this and, you know. But they definitely have something going on. Meaning, they already have something planned. This can be the other person. 
Oh, definitely. It's just like a matter of time now. It's Saturn in Purva Ashada, which is a big decision that will make that will happen in 2018 because it's time to take action now. It's time to, when, once you know the root of the situation with Mula, it moves to Purva Ashada, if I'm not mistaken. Now, the moment of waiting is done. Either you or this person is like, I'm done waiting. It's time for me to make action. It's time for me to make a move. That's a seven of wands. So someone, ah, uh, so, did I say seven of wands? Seven of pentacles. Let me see. It's time to be committed also. Ooh, this is about, got a seven of swords because, oh, okay. Because the other person, if you guys are far from each other, they don't know if you're cheating or lying. So someone, okay, here, they want to bag you, meaning bag you, put you in a commitment, or they want to put you in a commitment because it's like this. I don't know. It's not about, they're thinking about it. This whole distance, if you guys are distance, if there's something going on. But it's only a thought right now. But this is what they're preventing. Okay, but let me balance the energy with the Seven of Pentacles. See? Whoever is moving in, whoever is making it move forward, they're going to be sly about it. They will not explain themselves because this is already what's inside their head. The Two of Wands with the seven of, seven of Swords. I need to put this person, I need to lock down this relationship or this commitment. It can be a younger person that you're dealing with. This is also someone who works in the government, institution, society, very conscious of structure. Second house, Taurus also um, has an energy about, you know, not materialistic, but they do enjoy good things in life. Oh, six of Wands, uh-huh. There is a person who wants to claim the victory. They want, they really want this already. Because the other person can be attractive. They want, they have a lot of people around them. Okay. Let me see. So it's a secret jealousy here. Oh, see, slow and steady. They're doing it now. I feel like it's already happening. You just don't know that this person is really jealous. I mean, they, they don't like it. Like, you know, they're going to follow you. Okay, this can be you. Okay. And they see you as a like, okay, or this can be, you know, vice versa. But this is definitely a person who's following you. Okay. Because they don't want you to be with someone else anymore. Because they feel like you have options. They feel like if I wait more, this person probably will see other people. Okay. That's what I'm seeing here. All right. So Aquas, thank you very much guys for watching. Next to this is the Glamour Box. If you guys want to know about it. If not... Link down there in the description box should you need anything. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye, Aquas.